All right, so to start, we're going to be going to view, and then we'll go into command palette and type flutter new project. And then we're going to call this ca this project generate live captions. Oh, so we have to get rid of the, let's just get rid of the capitals. All right, call the project that, and then we'll find a directory to save it in. I'm going to save it in my normal directory. All right, and from here, we're gonna let everything load in, but there's gonna there's gonna be a couple dependencies that we're gonna require. So let's import those de dependencies. So go to your pubspec.yaml file and, and we'll add a couple of libraries. So the first one we'll add is HTTP. The next one is image picker. There. Seven plus four, and we'll also grab HTTP parser. We'll download some more later, but this should do for now. So to start off, let's go to main.dart and let's just start inputting our information. So the first thing we can do is remove all this code that Dart initializes. So let's just remove this class and let's remove this material app let's do that all right cool so let's just retur return a new material app and we'll call the title uh, generate live captions and the home will be my splash and then we'll remove the debug banner by setting this variable to false. <laughs> and that should be good for this class. So we are getting an error from my splash. So let's go into lib and create a new file and we'll call this one splash screen dot dart. And similar to all the other splash screens that we created, we're going to be creating a stateful widget and we'll call this one my splash. Now we have to import all of our dependencies, so let's do that. And we also have to import our splash screen dependencies, so let's do uh, package splash screen. Oh, so we have to also add our splash screen dependency. So let's just do splash screen pub get. All right, now let's go back to splash screen and we should be able to import this package. So let's just, all right, cool. So now the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna be returning a splash screen. So let's do that. And as you guys are aware, we'll have to add the seconds. So we'll do two and navigate after seconds will be home and the title will be text and we'll call this one text generator and the style for this text will be text style font weight font weight dot bold and the font size will be 30 and the color will be colors dot white and now what we're going to do is we're going to create a new assets folder for our image so let's create a new folder and we'll call it assets and we'll make sure we put in our pub spec dot yaml file so let's go to assets and uncomment this and we'll add our assets folder now from here we're going to want to drag and drop our image i uh, link this inside the lecture so just make sure you grab it from there and um, drag and drop the notepad.png file into this assets folder and this is what it looks like so that's going to be the image that we're going to be working with so now let's go back to splash screen actually let's just fix this fix this error in main.dart so just import that and all right cool so now we can start working on the gradient on this splash screen so 
After this text, write gradient background, and this takes in a linear gradient. So similar to the last ones, we'll begin at the top center, and we'll end at the bottom center. And then we'll stop at 0 0.004 and 1. And the colors will be color will be a list of color 0 x f f actually this one will be 0 0, zero x 1 1 2 3 2 5 2 6 and the next one will be color 0 x f f 2 3 2 5 2 6 all right cool <laughs> So now we have our gradient. Now the only thing we need to do is add a photo size parameter and we'll set this one to 50 and the loader color and we'll set that to colors.white and finally let's just create a home page so we can get rid of this error and we can run our app. So we'll create a stateful widget and this is going to be called home. Let's just make sure we return our required dependencies. And instead of this container, let's just return text and we'll call hello world. All right, now let's fix this error. All right, cool. Now let's run this project and that should be good for this lecture. Um, so we've done all of our basic UI components. So we've did our splash screen, um, we did our main, and now we're gonna start off on our home.dart file. So let's just see, make sure everything runs, which it should. This is the final app. As you can see, we're, we're gonna add some spacing between here, but for now, uh, this is what it's gonna look like. We're gonna be able to live, get a live camera and generate real time captions based off that live camera. And similar to the last couple apps, you can grab a photo from the gallery or take a one from the, the camera. All right, cool. So that works, but the only thing we're not seeing is the image. And the reason for that is because we haven't restarted the app and we didn't get the assets. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next lecture and we'll keep building up on top of our home.dart file. And yeah, see you guys there.